Luton and Dunstable University Hospital is a busy acute hospital just to the north of London that serves a population of about, well, depending on what service it is, about 300,000 to a million patients. We had used some of the prime real estate in the centre of the hospital to store a quarter of a million records. So we were very keen to reclaim that space for a um, cardiac centre. But then there was a large off-site archive with uh, up to a million records. The main challenge was to find them when you needed them. Uh, that was difficult. And if one set of notes was being required by three different people, then only one person would have it. We'd always be talking four or five hours of delay at best to get the paper record to the emergency department. And there was always a number of records that never quite made it or were difficult to obtain and there were delays. In order to stay as a financially viable organisation, we need to be taking cost out. And making the records available electronically is one of those drivers. And we're increasingly being driven to change our delivery models to deliver care in different locations and the inelastic nature of a paper record was becoming a break on innovation. We needed to glue together all the way from the paper archive to the on-site scanning bureau where there's high throughput thousands of notes each week are scanned, dematerialised and then the delivery onto the electronic document management system and the clinical interface which presents it to the clinicians via the iPad or the desktop PC. Patients come to the hospital with multiple problems and it is important for the patient's overall care that each of these departments are able to see what's going on in the other departments. And the digital record is absolutely perfectly placed to achieve that. And that service will deliver a cost benefit in terms of containing our costs, but preeminently the quality of information available to clinicians at the point of need. Xerox came in understanding this was a clinical environment, the importance of the notes, how important it was that if we didn't have them, we did everything we could to get them as quickly as possible. There's a patient on the end of it. Sometimes there's an operation that's either going to take place or not due to the availability of that information, and that's been absolutely crucial. Working with Xerox from the beginning meant that they actually understood the challenges in the paper system and were therefore able to help address those, both making sure the paper system continued to work until such point as we were scanning. The key thing about the digital record is the amount of times that the record can be accessed quickly at each point of the patient's journey. So there will be a sharper level of diagnosis and a better treatment plan available to the patients. And when they turn up acutely unwell, the information about the historic record is immediately available. You can begin pulling up that information wherever you're working, so you can get very good clinical decision-making in a timely manner. The fact that you've got password-protected access and that you've got a full audit trail of who's accessed and why gives us a better level of security than we had before. We haven't done anything this ambitious before, and so working with Xerox has been crucial. Your experience in delivering this kind of project in other trusts is absolutely pivotal. We looked at quite a few places before we went live and some places had chosen to try and do scan in-house. We're fully live, they're not yet and I think that itself tells a story. Our core business is to deliver healthcare. My advice would be to not to try and, because I've seen it go wrong in multiple places, is not to try and develop that capability yourself but to get a partner to, to, to deliver that. I'm very confident that um, Xerox and Luton and Dunstable will continue to work together very well and that we will continue to build on the solid foundations that we've got already um, and adapt as we find we need to adapt to improve things for our patients. Mm -hmm.